Napoleon Hill's 17 Principles of Success In this video, you will learn Napoleon Hill's 17 Principles of Success. Let us get started. This is Wealth Secrets TV. Don't forget to subscribe, and click on the bell icon so that you will not miss anything. Do you know you can achieve your goals by just following Napoleon Hill's 17 Principles of Success? Countless people around the world have benefited from these principles. Who is Napoleon Hill? He was an American author who spent a lifetime researching the secrets of success. Some of the highly successful men of his time shared their insights with him during his work. Successful people like Thomas Edison, Henry Ford, Alexander Graham Bell, Woodrow Wilson, and others. After Andrew Carnegie challenged him to research this topic, he later came up with the 17 principles of success. These principles serve as a dependable roadmap leading directly to the source of all riches. It's your turn to make use of these principles and join the League of Successful People. 1. Definiteness of Purpose. This is the starting point of all achievement. For everything you plan to do in life, you need a purpose and direction. Don't be a plane on the air without a rudder, powerless and directionless. We must have a clear understanding of what we want, how to get it, and this must be a burning desire, and passion for us. He closes this principle by saying, successful people move on their initiative, but they know where they are going before they start. 2. Mastermind Alliance. This is a friendly alliance between one or more people committed to helping each other achieve success. Just like Ratan Tata said, if you want to walk fast, walk alone. But if you want to walk far, walk together. Scientific practice has also proven that people who work together in harmony on a common goal, achieve more than one person. Cooperation and a robust set of combined skills are a key factor for achieving success. No man can become a permanent success without taking others along with him. 3. Applied Faith. This is a mental attitude wherein you may clear your mind of all fears and doubts, and direct it to the attainment of whatever you desire in life. It's our thoughts that shaped us to be rich or to be reduced. But when faith is added to the view, the subconscious mind instantly picks up the vibration, translates it into its spiritual equivalent, and transmits it to infinite intelligence. Remember, Napoleon Hill said, you can do it if you believe you can. 4. Going the extra mile. Those who are willing to go the extra mile are the ones who exhibit a spirit of excellence. The more effort you put in achieving a goal, the faster and better it will be accomplished. 5. Pleasing personality. This is a conglomeration of all the agreeable, likable, and gratifying qualities of you. This is a major asset principle in our everyday life. Goals are more comfortable to achieve when working with people who already show the readiness to work with you. Your personality is your greatest asset or liability, it embraces everything you control, mind, body, and soul. 6. Personal Initiative. This principle is the inner power that starts all action. It is a force of personal energy that arises from deep within and flows forth into positive, goal-oriented work. What action can you take to move toward your goal? How can this action be done? These are some of the questions you need to ask yourself to initiate your move. No man is free until he learns to do his thinking and gains the courage to act on his initiative, says Napoleon Hill. 7. Positive Mental Attitude. No purpose can be achieved without the right mindset. Positive thinking is a mental and emotional attitude that focuses on the bright side of life and expects positive results. It gives you the willingness to make an effort and take a chance instead of assuming your efforts won't pay off. The more positive everyone thinks that are involved in the desired goals, the more likely it is to achieve success. 8. Enthusiasm. Enthusiasm is the key to achieve success in business. It's a contagious state of mind that helps you gain the cooperation of others and, more importantly inspires you to draw upon and use the power of your imagination. 9. Self-discipline. Self-discipline simply means self-control. You are being able to do what you want to do, rather than being tossed around by your feelings like a leaf in the wind. You need to control your thoughts to control your need and desired goals. Self-discipline is the only thing in life over which you have total and absolute control. This principle is all about the mastery of your thoughts. 10. Accurate thinking. Accurate thinking is a moral duty. Nothing great can be achieved without precise thought. Correct thinkers are the masters of their own emotions. 
They recognize all the facts of life, both good and bad, and assumes the responsibility of identifying and choosing the one which is real and relevant. 11. Controlled attention. This is the highest form of self-discipline. It is the process of coordinating all the mind's facilities and directing their combined power to a given end. Achievement of controlled attention requires the application of six factors through the use of self-discipline. The six factors are, definiteness of purpose, imagination, desire, faith, willpower, and the subconscious mind. 12. Teamwork. This is the collaborative effort of two or more people to achieve or complete a task most effectively and efficiently. Cooperation is the medium through which high personal power may be attained. Teamwork, therefore, is a key asset, together with the other principles, for cooperative success and common desired goals. 13. Adversity and defeat. This is a principle that coffers the learning process the learning lessons from human errors and failures. You can learn from your failures and master the experience. Every adversity, defeat or disappointment carries with it a seed of an equivalent or more significant benefit. There is no such thing as defeat until we accept it as such. Change is constant in life, so as we go through life's twists and turns, Napoleon Hill states that the best application is making sure we apply a positive mental attitude to what we usually would view as failure. When we reframe it as only temporary defeat, our attitude toward everything will change for the better. 14. Creative vision. Imagination is your mind's exercise, challenge, and adventure. Imagination is the keyword to stimulate creative visions and business ideas. It starts with ideas that you can develop, ideas you can turn to money, possibly together with others. You can give life to it. To achieve this, your imagination must be free. 15. Health. Sound health is the key that coordinates all other principles and set all ideas into motion. In respective of whom you are, health is key to enjoy life and achieve personal fulfillment. Tracking everything you eat and exercising your brain will help you stay fit both mentally and physically to achieve your purpose. 16. Budgeting time and money. Napoleon Hill says, tell me how you use your time and how you spend your money, and I will tell you where and what you will be 10 years from now. Time and money are precious resources, and few people striving for success ever believe they possess either one in excess. Understanding how you use them is an important part of evaluating your progress toward achievement and analyzing what may be holding you back. Decide how to save and spend your money using the same techniques you use to save and spend your time. 17. Habits. We all want peace of mind, good health, and financial security. Therefore, one needs to develop a positive habit of achieving this. You manifest in your life that which you think. I hope you like this video. Click on the like, share, and subscribe if you like this video let us know if you like or dislike it in the comment below, and we will be glad to hear your feedback. Thank you we love you.